Oh, someone's been impaling goat heads. We're not going in there. Hello there. Traveler, are you by chance in need of a companion? Sorry, try someone else. Blast! It seems no one is willing to take this infernal dog off my hands. That's not your dog? <laughs> a possible response is, the dog is a good boy and you are a bad egg for despising it. But we're going to say, the dog, no thanks. I don't blame you. It's a filthy beast. Its hide is as foul as its breath and it's never at a loss for words. Worse yet, it'll lick things even Namira finds foul. And then, proceed to wipe its tongue on your face. That sounds accurate. But, uh, seems like a good dog. Hey there, hey there. Alright, well. <laughs> I hope they do okay. I hope she's not abusive to it. He seems happy enough, so I, I doubt she is. Is this the place? What is is this a person? Hello? I guess my flora mods have uh, hidden this person from view. I'll go into first person. So it's easier for y'all to see. Are they gone? We're hiding pretty well. Are who gone? Bandits? Bandits attacked and ransacked my cart. Can you help me? Uh Abino Cheese Monkey asks in chat, is the previous interaction interesting NPCs? I I believe it is. Uh, ransacked your cart. Um, I'm gonna go f fulfill a bounty on their head. You wanna help? My camp is nearby in the ruins of Nilheim. Get me there safely, and you'll be rewarded. The ruins of Nilheim? That's where the bandits are. According to my bounty letter. Let's go check Make it out. Vines. Let's move! Just be ready for a fight. It's just across the bridge and up that hill. Friend, friend, don't go running to that tower. Good afternoon. See you. One. I uh, just we should sneak, take it slow. We're close now. I can see the camp. This is no. This this is sus. Friend. Wait here. I'll be right back with your reward. Uh, Looks like we've got ourselves another fool. You picked a bad time to get lost, is friend. There? Huh? I think they were in cahoots. Oop! Sorry about that, folks. I think I we're being bamboozled. Oh, they know we're here. Ooh. We stay here. I'll show you what a real Death awaits you. Maybe we should take out our Telrav. Yeah, you're, you're going first. Back to the rocks. I hate to cheese NPCs like this, but... If we're as fleet as a cat, we might, might as well use our advantage. Oh, back up, back up. Ooh. Sure have mercy on you. I fought worse than I guess if we just get them all stuck in the terrain, problem solved, eh? Didn't stagger her. Oh, this guy's gonna murder us. Alright, we need to get out of here. It was a trap. Trapped. I'll mount your hand on my wall. Uh, 
Oh, no way out that way. Not with the falls right there. The whites take you. You puny weakling. Yep. I catch up. We're out of stamina. Um, I'm backing down. We're basically out of health potions. This is our last one. Oh, come on, stamina. Come on, stamina. Oh, they're right behind us. You're a fool to fight me. Oh, we're probably gonna get murdered now. Yep, we're gonna get stagger left and murdered. You're mine. Albino Cheese Monkey in chat says, loving the no UI mod. Yeah, it's working out better than I thought it might. Okay, we're gonna have to tackle this differently. Uh, hello. We don't need to talk to you again, but... Um, we can try the alternate dialogue route. Are they gone? Bandits attacked and ransacked my cart. Can you help me? What can my I do? My camp is nearby in the ruins of Nilheim. Get me there safely, and you'll be rewarded. We had the teensiest inkling that things weren't as they should be because of this bounty letter. We might ask, might inquire a bit more. I told you, I don't know anything else about it. You take me for a fool. I don't believe a word you say. Well, ain't that the truth of it? All right, then. Let's see what you've got. Killing you will make for an excellent story. Now ain't this a surprise? Are you just gonna attack us with fists? That's what you get for that. Suppose we don't have a bow. I don't really plan on using it. Well, we might actually have to. If we want to claim this bounty. There's an alternate way we might be able to do this, and that is by sneaking in at night. Let's see if we can't stake out this place a bit. Get somewhere with a good view, maybe up this hill. And sneak in when it's dark and we're not going to be immediately seen. Let's claim this bounty. Partially cloudy night. That's good. Is the moon obscured? Doesn't seem to have risen yet. Head to the tower first. We know there's bandits down there, but I'm guessing bandits aren't going to leave a structure like this totally unoccupied. We can claim the high ground. Is someone there? You heard something. <gasps> Time to ah, you. Oh, there's someone else in here. Oh, I heard someone behind us. <laughs> I guess it was a longer fall than it looked. Alright, we'll try one more time. <laughs> I like modded Skyrim. I like not just steamrolling everything. I like when difficulty settings actually matter. Oh, I need to see if there's a mod for the, um, sorry, the Aspen leaves. I think we will still try to take the tower first. But we're just going to have to wait to climb up here until that guy's back is turned. I think he's on a patrol route. But down the stairs, yep. I'm not sure if he, I'm not sure if he's gonna come all the way down. Turn around what was that? part way. Right. 
Time to end this little game. Too curious. I'll kill you. You call yourself a Nord? Okay. Possible. No one heard that. Because the bandit up here is sleeping. Possibly sleeping deeply. Iron War Axe of Jolts. 9 point static shock. 10% chance to deal 5 times damage. Well, we need the extra damage. Well, that was a bounty. We, Nolly and Nine Lives, might seriously at this point consider leaving the area and trying to claim the bounty. We may not have to kill all the bandits. I guess I'm weighing in my mind whether that counts as <laughs> cheese in the game or not. Scroll of Shadow Weave. Caster is invisible for. 103 seconds. When broken, cast regains invisibility shortly after. That's a super sneak. And I'm just as happy to see the potion of health. Okay. I think we will try to fulfill the bounty. Eliminate the bandits. Um, but if it goes badly, then we'll, we'll call it good enough. One cutting wood, one by the fire. I believe that's it. Uh oh. I didn't see this one. Well, I guess that was a 9% chance going off. That explosion. Whoa, nice. This is suddenly looking doable. Oh, I got a shield killed move. Alright. We're gonna look at our map, and we may sleep the rest of the night in Nielheim. I saw some beds. We know we played the area. That went reasonably well. Might take a visit to Dust Green Cave. I think we'll actually hit the road heading around here and stop at Iverstead. Hmm, where are we? Well, up there. Sarethi Farm. What is this place? This place is boring. Uh, Nothing but the same thing every day. That wasn't quite what I was asking. I mean, what's this place? Is that Nernroot? It looks like a farm enclosure. I wish I could head to one of the capital cities. Maybe even back I to heard Mornhold. the gourmets hiding out Maybe somewhere right in Skyrim. You know, fella who wrote that... We could always use help picking crops if you need a few extra coins. I'm curious about that nerd root. Actually, I'm growing it if you hadn't noticed. I'm the only person alive that can cultivate nerd root from a seed to a fully grown plant. I wasn't aware of that. The difficulties of farming nerd root. I had quite the mentor. He taught me everything he knew about the Nernroot and its strange properties. I haven't seen him in many years. I wonder what became of him. Are you an alchemist? I used to be. There isn't much time for that in my life anymore, I'm afraid. What do you do with the Nernroot? I actually owned a shop in Vivek City long ago. But I had to leave all that behind when the Red Mountain erupted. Perhaps someday I'll reopen a shop here in Skyrim. When was the Red Year? You must be old. <laughs> you seem quite exhausted. Is it that obvious? I've got my hands full here. Between the farm chores, cultivating my supply of Nernroot, and keeping a tight rein on my sister Adori, there's little time for rest. 
Um, I'm not sure what this help option is, but let's see what it is. Really? That would be a pleasant change. One of the ingredients I need to cultivate Nernroot are Jazz Bay grapes. The acidic content of the juice is perfect for the soil. I need 20 of them for my current crop. Good luck finding those Jazz Bay grapes. Well, we'll very rare. keep an eye out for it, but it's uh, not going to be a priority. 